Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a new background. I will have a video coming up on this transformation for you. But for now, uh, let's get into the video and I wanna welcome you to 2018. I'm excited to get filming regular videos. I have a comfy chair that I get to sit in and uh, film, which makes me very happy. And hopefully you will uh, join me as we start 2018. And if you are new to my channel, welcome, I'm Jamie. I hope you will um, stick around, subscribe to my channel. I bring a lot of different videos um, to you guys and I am a lifestyle channel and like to just uh, bring DIYs, cooking, baking, organizational videos, uh, decor, vlogs, and, and things like that. So I really thank you for stopping by. Today's video is a decor haul and I usually will start off the year with some decor that I like to freshen up after the Christmas season. I don't know about you, but I like to just you know, update a few little things, uh, usually in my living room, sometimes in a few other little places uh, in my home. But I just really wanted to change up my coffee table completely. The decor I have, I was inspired by Christmas to do something different this year. And that kind of has... Um, wanted me to do something uh, different going forward and I hope you will enjoy seeing some things that I've purchased and then I will be doing an updated um, like updates in my home and other videos coming up to show you everything so let's get started so home sense for those that don't know is the equivalent of what home goods is in the United States and I really wanted to change my vase and greenery that's what I usually go with I decided this time I wanted to go with like a glass vase with the acrylic water I think they call it and then some beautiful white roses so I was looking for more of a tall vase taller flowers uh, that's kind of what I wanted to um, change up to so this was $29.99 and I really love how this vase looks and the fl full flowers and the water and I think that will be really pretty and also from HomeSense let me find what I'm looking for. I've kind of recently been become obsessed with cute and really nice coasters. There's always something I seem to be obsessed with. I don't know if you guys do that, but there's one thing I always like to focus on. And right now it's cute coasters. I don't understand. I'm not going to question it. It's just what it is. And I thought these white marble ones are gorgeous. Uh, these were $9.99 and they are heavy like heavy and I love they've got the little um, foam feet on the bottom and they have some sustenance to the substance to them and I just thought they would be really gorgeous on um, on my coffee table and just to add a little bit of something with the flowers so I got these got two other things from HomeSense and they are hanging up already so uh, the first because I did this area I wanted to get a picture I was originally going to do a DIY to put in there and I changed my mind I saw this really adorable antler um, canvas picture that I thought was absolutely adorable so it is up on the shelf and I think it looks really cute. It has the antlers with a beautiful um, cream flower painted with a purple right in the center and I think it's absolutely beautiful and I love how it looks and that it's perfect on my shelf in the space. And the other picture I got is hanging up over to the left of me and I had a collage of four metal kind of pieces that I've had there now for about four years. and. With the change in this vanity space, I really wanted to just tie in when you walk in the door um, and have a really beautiful picture. So I saw this, it was $29.99 and I think it's absolutely amazing. It's like, it almost is like a shadow box, but it has this beautiful picture of, of like a, um, mannequin type thing i can't remember what the name that they're called um but then it has the black 
feathers on it and as a skirt and I just think it's absolutely beautiful. I had to get it. I knew it would fit perfect. I brought my tape measure because I knew the size I was looking for and I couldn't be more pleased how this picture looks. It's incredibly beautiful. I originally was looking for canvas and couldn't find anything that was the size I was looking for and then I was walking and walking and walking and walking. Like I just kept walking everywhere. I looked at a few different places, couldn't find the size or kind of in the budget I was looking for. And then finally, when I was about to give up, there this photo picture was behind a bunch of things. And I knew right away, I measured it and I said, this is the picture and it fits perfect. So I absolutely love it. It's different, it's unique, and it fits nicely in with this space. So that is what I got from HomeSense. Let us move on to decor out the door. Now you guys, if you've been following me for a while now, or if you're newer to um, my channel or my social media, I love to shop for decor. And there's a favorite store where I live that I'm absolutely obsessed with and just adore going in. And that is decor out the door. I've done a vlog on it. I've shared on social media. Um, I continually go in there to buy things and I've gotten to know the staff. Brienne is the owner. I love that she's a small businesswoman. I could go on and on and if you are interested, they ship, they have a website. I will link that uh, below for you. They ship throughout um, North America and whatnot, but check them out. They're amazing if you live in the city where I live. They're just such an amazing store. And Brienne herself owns a secondary company called Ebony and Ivory. She makes her own soy-based uh, candles. They're all hand-poured, and I'm obsessed with their candles. I haven't got, uh, purchased one of her large, large ones. I usually have gotten the half-size one, I think that's probably an eight ounce. I can't remember. And this one is Cookie Monster. And it's described as sugar cookies sprinkled with warm cinnamon. So this is a 16 ounce. I can't remember if I said that. And the smell is insane. And the other thing I love about her candles is the center wick. Um wood wick. It crackles as it burns and it really fills the air up beautifully. I I'm obsessed with her candles and that, you know, supporting a local business is amazing and she does, has so many different scents. And I saw the large one and I thought this would look absolutely gorgeous on my coffee table and the scent is just insane. If you haven't had a chance to um, smell her candles, you are seriously missing out. They're highly addicting, and over this last year, they've become my favorite um, candle to burn um, over Bath and Body Works. Although I have many and I burn them, this has been my go. These have been my go-to candles to burn. I am obsessed with coffee, morning coffee. I love my morning coffee. I love to do story time Snapchat. I like to show what kind of coffee I get, have every morning. And I'm obsessed with cute and awesome mugs. And also at Decor Out the Door, they carry a whole line of so many different kinds of mugs. And I was walking around and said, how can I not get this mug? It says, I like big mugs and I cannot lie. The packaging is incredibly cute. This would be an amazing gift to give to someone and to just keep the box to give as a gift to someone. It's so darn cute. And then inside, I've been wanting a double layered, double insulated, I can't remember if that's what they're called, glass mug. And I haven't found anything that I've really, really loved or fell in love or really, really like. And this, I, I just, absolutely love this mug. It is dishwasher and I think it says it's microwave safe as well. Let me just see here. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's dish dishwasher, top rack, and microwave safe. It's an insulated wall. It, the, it's 
eco-friendly, BPA-free, insulated wall, keeps beverages hot or cold, and it is a 12 ounce mug. So everything says, yes, I don't have to hand wash you. It can go in the microwave also, and it can go in the dishwasher and in the microwave if you so wish, but isn't that cute. I can't wait to start using this. It is by the brand um, Cypress Refresh. Never heard of them, but they are, um, the business is in Richmond. Cute mug and I had to get that. So stay tuned. You'll be seeing that in Snapchat coming up. Now I've had the same tray on my coffee table for four years or so. It's a mirrored tray, it's got dark wood and I absolutely love it, but I've gotten to the point where I'm ready to look at something else. I wanna change it, so I was on the hunt for a new gorgeous tray and when I was there, I saw this one. It's so light, I love the size, I love the color, like almost this kind of stone marbly wood look, fin like look to it and then I love the handles very similar to what I did for my own DIY I did a DIY chalkboard tray and these look very similar to what I put on mine maybe that's why I fell in love with it but I tend to love like square or rectangular rectangular trays for some reason they're my thing and I decided to get this I just can't believe how light it is, and this was $47.99. I love it, I don't care when I see something I love, I will get it. Um, yes, that's how I like to shop and I can't wait to incorporate all that on my coffee table. Now the last thing I got it to core out the door is something I'm so excited. It's the last thing I, knew I need to do to finish updating my uh, coffee bar. I totally changed it all around, updated it, and I'm gonna be doing a video on that as well on my updated coffee bar area because now I feel like it's more of a coffee bar and not just like a coffee area. And if you saw my Christmas Day vlog, you would have seen Derek gifted me with a new coffee machine, a Cuisinart. I absolutely love it. There's so many awesome things about it, features, bells and whistles that it has. And with that, it inspired me to just make the area look more like a coffee bar. I wasn't ever 100% happy with it. And there we go. I have seen letter boards, letter signs, whatever, coming up and becoming quite popular. And I decided, you know what? I was trying to think what kind of sign, because I've always wanted to put a sign there, but it wouldn't fit with everything that I had. And redoing it has a, is a, will allow me to do that. And I thought a letter sign would be perfect. And because I love chalkboards, this is kind of a different way of doing that. And then I can personalize it throughout the year. And I'm so excited. And you can find them everywhere. You can find them on, well, not everywhere. What am I saying? You can find them on Amazon as well. If I can find a link, I'll, I'll put it below for where you could find your own uh, letter sign, letter board, and there's different sizes and colors and types. The one I wanted was the one that has felt, black felt with a wood frame. They have ones that have the plastic instead of the felt. Those are significantly less money. I wanted the felt one. That's just the look I was going for. So mine, I'm so excited, came in this beautiful box and it comes so beautifully wrapped. Like, look how gorgeous this is. Mine is a 10 by 10 and it's by the company Shop Words and Co. That's what it's called, Shop Words and Co. And I'll put that on the screen here. And they've put a really, really cute little thank you. They have um, Instagram and it looks like these guys, I'm not sure if they're a Canadian company. If they are, that's awesome. They have a website, but it comes with quite a few letters. Ooh, do you guys like to do that? Pop, that's really off topic, but pop. Anyways, I'm gonna keep doing that, but pop those little things that are safe, you know, wrapped to keep your packages safe. I'm getting distracted, but it comes with a number of, of um, 
letters and numbers and I'm really honestly excited to start setting this up and I think it's going to be so cute to kind of change up throughout the different seasons and as I said Amazon I've seen them there and I just really love it there there's just so many different varieties of them that you can get so if you are interested in one of these either check out decor out the door I don't know if they have them on their website you can check that out or I'll leave the link like I said to uh, Amazon where I believe I've been able to find them if you're interested but it's a really cute way to personalize there's even little arrows and signs dollar signs like I just think that is cute so stay tuned to see that as well the last place I went to was chapters and when I went to decor out the door home sense and chapters Pat, you know, post Christmas, I got gift cards to shop at all these places. So I didn't pay full price for any of this. I was able to utilize gift cards, which is awesome. It's my favorite thing to get at Christmas time, let's be real. And Chapters was having a huge, huge sale. Now they, of course, are known for books, but they have a really beautiful home decor section. And it is on the pricier side, I'm not going to lie. But whenever I go in there and I decide to look at things, I wait to see what they have on sale. Because when things go on sale there, it's th th seriously the most amazing prices ever. And immediately, I saw this gorgeous, and I'm not going to tell, I'm going to tell you how insanely priced this was. This is an absolute beautiful, cozy, faux fur throw. It is a size, see if I can find it. 50 by 60 inches and I love the cream color. I'm going to, I hope incorporate it in this area. It's so cozy, so warm. It has a really beautiful soft inside and it's gorgeous. And I just love how it is packaged, tied around with a bow. And okay, so let me just tell you that I would never, this is just me, I wouldn't pay the normal, that regular price is $80. I am not kidding you, $80. No, I will not pay that for a blanket. I'll pay it for other things, but I won't pay it for a blanket. Isn't that, I've said it before, I can't understand why I justify certain prices for things and other times I refuse to pay. I have no idea whatever, but this was $80. Then they had it marked down on sale for $25 and I went, yes, I think that's pretty darn good because I've seen very similar ones at Pier 1 for significantly more around the same price as what these guys are asking. But, oh, it's so soft, guys. It's seriously amazing. So I thought $25 is perfect. And then I get to the register and as she's ringing everything in, I kind of, because I had calcul pre-calculated the few things I bought, okay, and with my gift card, okay, whatever. And then she told me the price and it was less than what I calculated. And I said, well, th that's less than what I thought. And she says, yes, the sale items were on even another 30%. I got this throw for $13. I don't have my receipt. No, I think I threw out the receipt. Oops, I think it came to maybe $15, yeah, it's gotta be more like 15. 15, I don't know, 13, $15 and some change. For this, that was regular $80. If you live in Canada and you have a chapters, go check out their decor section right now because all their sales stuff is on 30% additionally. And you could get a gorgeous, gorgeous faux um, throw for like 13 to $15, that's insane. And it's a very neutral color, so it would go any time of the year. Just putting it out there. Okay, I lied, I have my receipt. <laughs> and I got it for $17.50. Yes, I was going a little bit under that, but still, for $17.50, I got an amazing deal on that throw. There you go. So I needed to get a new calendar. I'm one of those that likes an old fashioned large calendar. I don't mind having a desk one for weekly things, but I like to have a monthly calendar where I write, I write all my bills when things are due. That's how I do my um, 
I plan all my bills and where my finances are. I still use a regular calendar. So, of course, they have calendars in there and they were 30% off. And who doesn't like a calendar with yoga dogs on it? This got me, look at this guy. And then on the back, it has all the names of all the different dogs doing yoga poses. I don't know how they do it. Obviously it's Photoshop, that's what I'm thinking because the poses are hilarious. I'm just looking at it. But all the dogs are in some various yoga pose and I just said, okay, this would bring a happiness to me like there's no tomorrow. I couldn't help myself. I just think it's so cute and each month they have the name of the animal and I don't know. I just think it's so cute. It's just so cute. So if you happen to see this, let me know. But Yoga Dogs 2018 calendar, heck yes, I had to get it. And the last thing I got was this beautiful Fraser fur. Do you see that there? Amazing pine candle. I got a small one before Christmas. Then they carry these as well because I got mine at um, Decor Out the Door. Very small one to try. And then I saw that Chapters carries these candles. Amazing. I love it. And it was on sale and I had to get it. And it gives the most amazingly fresh pine scent. It's not overpowering. It's just very subtle, but it gives you a little something cozy, you know, during the winter months. If you live in an area that's very cold, like it can, like it's freezing here right now um, with snow, it just reminds me of that, like pine needles and being outside and I just love it. So I picked up another one, but in a bigger one, a bigger size and I'm burning it and it's so amazing and it's the Fraser Fur line of candles. And that is it guys. That is my decor haul. I hope you enjoyed seeing things that I will be updating. Coming up, you'll see various different videos of where I've incorporated all these things from updates to tours to whatnot. And I hope that you will enjoy seeing where these things are put and just to see the updates on all my other social media as well, like Instagram and um Snapchat and I also will share on my blog and on Facebook. So as of now, I am on all various aspects of social media. I'm even on Pinterest. I don't go on Twitter, but I'm pretty much on everything else. So you can find me and find me anywhere. <laughs> so have a wonderful day guys i'd love to know what your favorite thing was that i have hauled here today just let me know in the comments below and i'll see you in the next video bye guys